Wow, you look great. You look like you're just like beaming and, and healthy and happy and yeah, all that. I feel good. I yeah. feel good, yeah. Yeah, because you're like two months away from, from a fight, and so you must be in like top condition right now. Yeah, I've been doing, I'm training twice a day since the beginning of August, so. Yeah, I finally feel like in super ninja good mood. Cause it's been, uh, <laughs> cause it's been uh, uh, over a year, right? About a year since you fought last. Yeah. So when you when you train, do you not only fight, but what other workouts do you do to train? What other workouts do I do? Do you do like like lots of jump rope and lots of cardio and stuff like that? We do a lot of like running, jumping, climbing trees, anything like different to make it like you know interesting every day. Do you like, climb oh, trees, really? I can climb a tree. I can climb the hell out of a tree. Wow. Yeah. Do you just like see a tree and, and say I'm gonna climb that tree? I mean, you gotta wait for like a good one. Like an African coral tree is really like oh, my favorite, you yeah. know. But you never know. You a know? good coral tree, but those those <laughs> limbs they'll, they'll snap on you pretty quick because they do. Just coral trees. What are you trying to say? I'm, I'm just saying they snap. <laughs> just be careful. I don't want you to get hurt. All right. So, so it's December 30th, right? That's yeah. the fight? So that's kind of like the holidays. That ruins like Christmas and everything for you, doesn't it? I mean, it just postpones it. I mean, my, my nieces love it because they think they get double the Christmas because we call it second Christmas. We have it afterward. Right. And they think they get twice the presents, not the same presents split in half. So. Right. So now you're going to fight this fight, and you will win, I assume. Um, and then w w how much longer will you keep fighting? Because it's, you know, it's a dangerous business. Not that long. I'm wrapping it up. This is definitely one of my last fights. So. One of your last fights. Yeah. You better, everyone better watch. Cause yeah. The show is going to be around forever. Well, especially if you're saying that, we are gonna, I mean, we were going to watch anyway. But yeah, <laughs> I mean, because I would think, because I, I know there's a lot of other things you can do and want to do. And, you know, and I understand you wanting to go back in the ring and, and fight and, you know, be the champion, and which you will. Thank you. you. Do you and do you, because it's physically, mentally, everything. You have to be, you know, you have to be strong, but you also mentally have to go in with an attitude, right? Yeah, I think it's more the buildup that's tire, more tiring than anything else. Like, if we had a fight right now, I'd be like, I'd fight right now, and then I'd go get dinner, and I wouldn't feel, like, really tired about it. It's like the weeks and weeks of buildup beforehand, and you know you're fighting this one person, and it's like your showdown, the most important thing in your whole life, and then millions of people are watching. It's like, it's that buildup for weeks on end. If it just happened right now, I wouldn't be nervous at all. It's yeah. the waiting. Well, I think that's the truth for, for all of us, for anything. If there's a lot of energy and an anticipation and anxiety that, that burns, and it's, it's all senseless. It's all useless. Um, we have the New York Times sitting here because um, you've been following the election, as, as we all have, and there was something that, uh, <laughs> that was in here, because your name is mentioned in here. Yeah. Do you know about this? I heard I made a very prestigious list. <laughs> yeah. Um, so, I, and I just, I just saw this this morning. I don't know if it's opened up to the, to the page or not. Yeah, these are, these are people and uh, places and things Donald Trump has insulted on Twitter since declaring his candidacy. And it's, it's this entire page, and you made the list. Yeah, not a nice person. How'd that happen? Um, I don't know exactly. I think he said I was going to vote for him, and I, I, it was news to me, you know? Yeah. And um, I just said, I'm, I'm not voting for a reality TV star to be the president. I mean, yeah. it's just all I said. Right. And so that makes me not a nice person. Not a nice apparently. person. Those, those two things are related. It's yeah. like, you know, right. connected to each <laughs> if other. If you're not for him. Yeah. Um, wow. Well, congratulations. It's Thank a, you. I'm going to frame it. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> right next, I, don't, I put my belts in like an ottoman. I put my feet on them, but that's yeah. going to be on the wall. That's going to be on yeah. the wall. <laughs> <laughs> um, and how's your boyfriend, Travis? Oh, he's amazing. I mean, today I was going on Ellen, so he made me like coffee in my Ellen mug. And then, yeah, we went to the dog park, and there was like this like bench that's covered in you know rain and like dirt and everything. And he like sits down and he scoots and like cleans the whole thing with his butt for me. Like before I sit down, I'm like, wow, that's like the modern equivalent for putting your coat over a puddle. Like yeah, I just, yeah. I just loved it. Oh my god, yeah. That's so that's sweet. Yeah, now, he, he's got me domesticated now a little bit. Well, yeah, but because what are you going to do? If, so if you're saying you're winding down, what will you? I know you're knitting. Well, I know. that's more, it's not like part of my domestic thing. That's part of my apocalypse plan. Oh, I, I see. I'm a big doomsday prepper. I like to get ready for the end of the world and stuff like that. And, and knitting I, is how you're doing it? Yeah, because how are you going to get clothes, you know? Yeah. I, 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 I have a lot to learn, though, you know? I'm <laughs> yeah, Kat Denning said that you're in the knitting club with her. Yeah, and the that, uh, yarn and the restless. Yeah, the yarn and the restless. <laughs> yeah. yeah. But it's more of a drinking club, and you can yeah. tell which parts of the. Well, here's my scarf. I mean, what's my? I call it blank scarf because it started out as a scarf, and you can tell which ones are the sober sections and which ones aren't. Um. 
See, this is like right after my last fight. I was a lot more sad. Uh huh. This is a sad section. Yeah. You see me getting happier as yeah. I could come along. Wow. Right? I'm impressed by it, though. Thank I think you. it's really good. Um, and I think you're a nice person, by the way. I think oh, you're very okay. nice. Uh,